doing something different. If you choose the color blue, your name is gonna be green. Hey guys, and welcome back to IT News. In today's video, we'll be showing you guys how to spice up your Among Us experience with some awesome new game modes you need to try out. First, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel to see more videos like this and much more. Turn on notifications too so you don't miss out on a future video. Alright, let's just jump right into this. We're kicking things off with hide and seek. You lot, you lot, you lot. Simon, don't leave me. Simon! I've left you. Bro, why? No. Oh! Run, boys! He's in the bottom left corner! He's behind you, Elam! Elam, he's behind you! Which is the most popular and well known custom game in Among Us. We're pretty sure you've heard of this one before, and it made it to the list because it's just really awesome. I'll take you guys through the rules of hide and seek. The imposter must sabotage comms and announce themselves as soon as the round begins. The imposter gives crewmates 5 second head start to run away. You're free to talk at any time. No reporting bodies, no fixing comms, no emergency meetings and no sabotages besides comms of course. No reporting, no meetings. Okay. Right. They can't see I'm anything. Only sabotage comms. We have 5 times no banning. Oh, crewmates. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> so what is the aim of the game? Do your task and, task and don't die. Okay. Don't die. Just okay, and as an imposter, oh, you just got oh, to kill. Oh, so you, you just got to kill. Okay, cool. Right. Yeah, it's just one round. No, no sabotaging right. either. No sabotage. Okay, right. so yeah. we'll pretty much know who they are. We just can't vote them off. Oh yeah, we don't yeah. even need. Oh, you don't even talking. need to mute. Yeah, we're not We're not muting as well. Oh, okay, right. okay, love that. Okay. And here are the settings you'll need to run this mode. Next, we have small talk. All right, Vic. Five words. I I see Randy's body. Navigation. <laughs> <laughs> Small talk is a game of clarity. You need to be able to communicate with everyone, but with only a limited amount of words. You're only allowed to use three words per meeting. This rule applies to everyone. This really changes the game a lot. <laughs> Spraggy. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> Marshall milk. Vikram sus as hell. Vote. <laughs> what was your last word? Vote. <laughs> Here are the Among Us small talk rules. There isn't much of it, it's pretty straightforward. You'll need to play the game like normal, but each player is only allowed to have a maximum of three words each. As for the settings, you literally just run a normal game of Among Us match. You, you know, like, you don't really need to change that. Number three, colorblind mode. Um, remember, remember, you cannot give away what color you are. I, I, I think I saw white over here by uh, by tree with me. Pink white? Wait, wait, wait. wait no, 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 white. no. Yeah. yeah, pink white. Sorry, pink white. You saw pink I, white? Wait, oh, okay. Wait, wait, no. where, where was the yeah. body? Wait, where was the yeah, body? Where was the Body. Where was the body? Was it, uh, in, in the northeast, uh, whatever that room is that has the telescope in it, and I found uh, lime purple. I don't know if I trust that you reported it. Why wouldn't you trust me? <laughs> I, you are, yeah. You're probably not even purple cyan, are you? Colorblind mode is a game that you need to try and play if you really want to get confused. Try playing with these settings, you'll have no idea who is who. Enjoy the chaos as it unfolds. These are the colorblind rules. Players must remove all skins and cosmetics and set their name to a completely different color than the actual color that they're in. So for example, red colored crewmates set their names to yellow, you know, the gist of it. With something different. If you choose the color blue, your name is gonna be green. And to add to the craziness, you are not allowed to refer to players by their descriptive indications like their name, colour, light, dark, any player's real name. If you really want to challenge yourself, then this game mode is definitely for you. As for the settings, you just need to run the game as normal, it's, it's already one heck of a challenge as it is. Number 4, no talking. I think it's five up.
We already have limited words, but how about no words at all? This is the no talking game mode. In this game mode, you are not allowed to talk, whether it's through text or verbally. Just completely prohibited. One round of absolutely no, no interaction with Discord, nothing. And then we just go back to normal gameplay. And then, yeah. Okay, so, so, okay. No communication whatsoever, no typing, no typing. No, no typing, typing, no nothing, but you're allowed, you're to, to, and be like, you're allowed to jiggle in game though, and, and signals. So even if you've seen someone vent or kill, you cannot utter a word. I guess all you can do is just keep voting them. You only have your votes that can do the talking. This game mode is most likely to make you tear your hair out because of the amount of stress you're about to go through. But hey, you'll get plenty of laughs along the way as well. As we said, the rules for this game is no talking or typing at all times. Instead of inside or outside of the meetings, speak with your votes. And obviously with the settings, you just need to say as normal. Number five, Murder She Wrote. Murder She Wrote is a game mode that really stretches the game out. This is because the extended task settings means that game is slow to a snail's pace. In this game mode, the only person who's allowed to answer any incoming questions is whoever reports the body or calls the meeting. Anyone else can ask the questions as long as they don't directly incriminate the other, but it's down to the person with the megaphone to relay any information. You also can't go back and answer questions from previous rounds. I have literally no information right now, but we have cameras. Who's on the cameras? Carl, standing completely still. <gasps> Sapnap, it's Sapnap. They did it right on the camera. Oh my god! I called Sapnap out! Yes, George, go report it! I put myself right in front of a camera! Yes! This is all about having good memory and remember who is where, as the person with the megaphone is the only one who can say I'm voting X and get the others to share their mindset. With only one killer though, make sure you get your facts right. Here are the rules for the murder she wrote. There can only be one killer within a 10 player lobby, whoever reports the body is the only person who can answer the questions, crewmates can ask as many questions as they want using the text chat, but all questions must be addressed to the person who reported the body. You can also ask absolutely anything, other players location, who's been with who, but it's all down to the person who reports the body to answer the question. Here are the settings for the mode, I mean it's, it's pretty simple obviously, and yeah, go have fun with it. Those game modes seem pretty interesting, right? Which one are you most excited to play? Let us know down in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys did enjoy the video, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel to see more videos like this and much more. Click on the bell notifications too, so you get notified every time we upload a new video. We'll see you guys next time, but until then, bye for now.